It's an honor and a privilege to work every day alongside women and families in New Mexico. In my position at Young Women United, I hear their stories, I hear their heartbreak, and I hear those challenges they face in raising healthy families in our state. I also have a story to share. When I was in college, I was a victim of sexual violence. Many would say that maybe I deserved what was coming because I'd previously been in a relationship with the person who ended up sexually assaulting me. But I knew at the time when I did not report the crimes against me, being crossed against state lines, being held against my will, and being sexually assaulted repeatedly, I did not report those crimes, not because my life was threatened, but because of the If the Martinez and her administration, our Governor Martinez, know anything about rape, it's one of the most and is the most underreported crime that happens in New Mexico and across the country. If people like me have not reported their crimes for concrete reasons like the safety and well being of ourselves and our families, then should we go to apply for child care assistance as a result of a rape or a rape that ended in pregnancy? We have nothing on the books, we have nothing to show, and instead we'll be pulled back into um, a cycle of violence that we don't deserve to be in.